Hello, welcome back to Splatterhouse. Now, we uh, we picked up that picture of Jenny last time across the hole and uh, getting my ass kicked by some horrible fish demon. Oh, shitbag. You wanna start shooting me, do you? Ow, oh, uh, apparently does. Fuck. Right, I need some blood. Preferably yours, not mine. Oh, hello. Oh no, I killed him! Well, I mean, that's what I wanted to do, but I mean, I wanted to kill him in a more grotesque manner. Oh. Oh, that's just blood exploding. Alright, so we're in this lovely 2D section. Urgh. Okay, these guys squirting their shit everywhere are just absolute nightmares, so let's, uh, let's pound them until they stop moving. Oi! Seriously, we're gonna, we're gonna have to agree to disagree. Oh, Jesus, that's a lot of dudes. Right, let me, uh, let me suck them all off a minute. Right, which one of you buggers is gonna, uh... I'm actually get completely out of blood, actually. Come on, who's gonna be on my uh, my naughty list to explode? They're actually surprisingly sturdy. You! No, Rick, there we go, thank god. Right, once we got this guy's head pulled off like so. Whoop. Amusingly, the frame rate's better here because it's the camera's further out, so it makes it like a bit quicker. Right, now we've done that, we can actually have a bit of breathing room to kill the rest of these dicks. Kill it. Here we go, and there's another one. Perfect. Let me tug off this fine lad's arms. He doesn't need them. Beautiful. And then we can kill the rest of these fine brothers. So. Oh, I completely missed. Wow, I didn't actually get as much blood as I was Oh! Well, never mind. Let's just tug this fine head. Oh, I, I keep thinking that's gonna pull their heads off, but it just really doesn't. Mm, whatever. Whoop. Alright, are we done? Look at all this blood. That's one thing I really like the game for, it's just the persistent mess on the ground. Which probably doesn't, it probably exacerbates the very much. Oi! These guys are real dicks. I should totally dodge out of the way every, every time they go down, but I can always forget. There we go. And then I forgot to... Oh well. Whatever. Moving on. If the bridge randomly breaks on me now, I'm not going to be very happy, just FYI. Oh. Boop. Always came to go the end of the world. Congratulations. Is it a blah, blah, blah. <laughs> Rick's just sick of the mass shit at this point. I like it though. You can talk to me, Jim Cummings, anytime you like. Seriously, you're my favorite you're actually my favorite bit of this LP. You're really funny. Uh hmm. Just seems to be a nice walkway of not a lot. I mean, I'm, I'm okay with that. We've, we've done a lot of splatting. Oh, there we go. Man, I've really got to load up my 360 version. I've got to dig out my Xbox and see if the frame rate is bad on that one. Because i got a sneaky suspicion this might be the worst of the two ports. Oh, we got a lot of blood. We should totally spend that. Um, what should we do? None of those are particularly interesting. Sprint roll. Si better Psycho Ram. We could do that, I suppose. More health. Oh, we decided the radius of the splatter siphon wasn't that interesting, didn't we? Uh, let's do a better ram. Yeah, sure, why not? And let's save it for the increased splatter siphon range, because it, it might be a bit boring, but hey, it might be useful. Okay. Yo, Dr. West! Dr. West! My frames have gone missing, can you help me find them? You're a doctor, right? Whoop. That night! I vowed that all men should suffer, as I have suffered! But I... was wrong. Pain okay. and suffering are born of life. That much is clear to me now. So this is my gift to you, to all mankind. An end to all suffering. An end to all life. Yes, the corrupted will spare mankind any further pain. And Lenora and I shall be reunited. Yeah? Well, fuck you. No! Fuck you! <laughs> well, that was childish, boys. <laughs> well, there's something funny about an old 1700 professor like screaming fuck you, but hey. Oh, hello. Me's. Oh. 
Well, they're angry. Let's... Okay, we need to heal, otherwise we're going to have a really bad time here. Alright. Sure we can. I mean, we could transform, but I feel that uh, that's not as effective as just kicking the shit out of them. Gotcha, bitch! He says, immediately getting shit kicked out of him. What we could do is this. It does a shitload of damage. I mean, they're basically like me, but not as good as me, right? At least that's what I'm hoping. That's the only downside of using the very slow um, triangle triangle moves. At least they can hit each other. I've been getting it for the last 10 hours, Mask. Come on, man, give me a break. Right. At least it does a lot of damage. Okay, let's get... We're getting cornered, but them attacking each other is actually really useful. Oh, man. I swear the in roll being invincible thing is not as, uh, not as good as I hoped it would be. Because the iframes on the roll are still pretty shitty. Oh, ouch. Right. Oh, come on, really? I got scammed out of that heal there. We have to heal through that one. Okay, I need one of these guys to go down pretty I can't see anything, game. Give me a break. Oh, one of those guys has got small and skinny. Oh, Jesus. A lot of this fight, I'm actually fighting the camera. Oh, come on. Okay, that's one of them now. Yeah, he got, to be fair, he gives me plenty of time to dodge, but if you start your one of your combos midway through that, you're gonna have a bad time. We're not losing. Well, we kind of are, I suppose. Wee! Well, alright. Well, let's have a look through here first. Boop. Eesh. As is the correct fashion. Oh, not through that one. Sure enough, nudity. Well, Jenny, that's a nice uh, jumper you've got there. Though we've seen you've got some blood on your leg, but never mind. There you go. I believe that is the last breasted picture of Jen of the game, so enjoy. Run him. Let's check the other gate. Oop. Wait, I thought I'd have got an achievement for that or something. A trophy or some shit. Damn it, I game I collected all the nudity. What do I get? And if the answer's not more nudity, I'd be surprised. Right. Oh, I figured there would be ballworms in here or something. Never mind. Alright. I'm coming, Dr. West. Don't worry. I killed your friends. They were pretty sturdy, but I managed to just heal through it because I'm really bad. The sacrificial altar is on the other side of the chapel. You, you okay there, Mask? That you sound a bit excited or worn out or something. Ooh, hello. I guess we should try and stop that, right? Yeah, so one more stage to go. Maybe there was pictures on the last stage? I didn't think there would be. In fact, I'm like 99% sure there isn't. So. Oh, whatever. Alright, well I'm willing to fight through pretty much everything and anything to get to Jenna at this point. In fact, I think I have. I mean, how many more assholes do I have to pull out to, you know, get shit done? Probably all of them is the answer.
You're over there, PlayStation. You're having a bad time. He's he's going. Oh, sorry. You you pit of you pit of stop loading. Are we, are we good? Are we good? You okay? I'm a bit worried. It's a rather long loading time you got going on here. Oh, here we go. Fantastic. Phase twelve. The devil made flesh. Oh, good. Gorgo, Morgo, thousand faced moon, look favorably upon the sacrifice. No! Um, get your hands off my girls. Jen! We did it, didn't we? We stopped the ceremony. Something's still trying to force its way through. It's too late, Rick. The sacrifice. One sacrifice isn't enough to open the gateway. Not one, not one thousand, but ten thousand sacrifices. And you, Rick, you have been the executioner. I want vengeance for an eternity of agony. I want the corrupted to know that it was me stopped them. To do that, I gotta let him out. Guess we got some ass kicking to do that. Also, Dr. West took one right from the face. He did not look like that in the cutscene. He looked cooler. Scam. <laughs> <laughs> he doesn't look. He doesn't like. He cares so much about being a big, you know. Hey, Jen. Rick, help me. Jenny, I'm coming. That's Jen. I want to see what's inside. All right. I guess we're gonna keep these fools away from Jenny. It's an escort mission. I love escort missions. No wait, that's the wrong word. I forget. I've even splatting too many dudes to work out what's what anymore. Ow. Yes! I mean, in theory, as long as nothing nothing spawns behind me, we should be okay, right? Right, you. You're getting your whatever pulled off because I need extra health. To All right, now what? Do we actually fight this monster, or do we just kill bits that come off of it? Hey, what's this over here? Oh, that is a do not walk into it button. Okay, you pause. Oi, that way. Jenny can't heal like I can. She's not she's not as good. You're right there, Jenny. Alright. I'm really worried we're gonna miss some oh, like that. Ah they're they're, they're gonna go straight to Jen, not me. That's really inconvenient. At least I can't hurt Jen, I don't think. Alright, let's stop that. I'm working on Jen. There's a lot of dudes here, though. I'm working on it, Jen. Oh, <laughs> 
I know she's dying. This is really hard. They just ignore you totally. This makes this a freaking nightmare. I'm trying, Jenny. This is not easy. Where, like, where did all these guys even come from? I think she's dead. This is gonna be rough, isn't it? This is gonna be so, so rough. Alright, I'm gonna try this again. I've got more blood. I've done, done a few attempts of this now. Uh, it's, it's really, really freaking difficult, like, I'll be honest. Uh, however, I've got a new move that lets me tear off the arms, like, instantly off the dudes, and I'm hoping that, uh, that really helps her. So what we're gonna do is quickly clear these guys. The key is actually not letting Jenny take too much damage at the start, I think. And what we do here is grab a guy and just rip his arm off. It does have got quite a bit of blood damage as well. Instantly kills them too. So any of the bigger guys can be just instantly killed like that. So I think we basically splatter them. We splatter one of the big guys, pull the other like arm off the other big guy, and do it that way. So we just get one of the smaller guys with that. Crap this guy like that. And then um, we chase these guys this way and beat them. Turn around. Problem is the camera kind of fights you the entire way, which is really unhelpful. Um, also, what you can do, you can grab one of these guys and pump them back. So, force them to turn around, like so. We can do that and get them all in one go. And this one. Hit him harder! Get away. I think Jen took a hit there. You can do this, of course, to slow them down, too. It's the little guys that are the problem. Especially when the game doesn't let you grab them. There we go. Oh. Also, fighting up here is a mistake, because the uh, camera angles are just really unpleasant. Okay. This is good. We can just pull this guy's arm off instantly and kill him. I think we've got them all together. We just stun these guys, like... Well, trust me, I am as focused on Jennifer as one can be. However, they can occasionally slip through. Okay, just splat these guys then. You go that way. I don't know if I can pull the arms off these guys too. Yeah, I can. Doesn't do as... It gets you a weapon, which is useful, but... Yeah. What you need to do is clear this lock. Smash. And then pull his arm off. Jenny takes a bit of damage doing this. However, I can then do that. And then... There we go. Make sure he dies. Jenny took a hit there. Working on it, Jenny. Pull his arm off. We're doing better this time. We're doing better. I think we're almost there. Anything else? Okay, we've actually done a lot better there. Okay. Checkpoint reached, thank goodness for that. That was tough. Jennifer! Oh, quick time event! Mash the buttons! I love quick time event. Let's do it. Oh, are we gonna go full mask? Oh look, it's a giant moor. What what do we need to smack? I'm I'm game for smacking anything at this point. Oh yeah, I'll have this. Yep. What is it, some sort of weird penisy tendril? Yep, that sounds like I need to tug that off. Yep, here it goes. Beautiful. Whee! Oh, oh, this is getting, oh, this is getting gribbly. Oh, that looks, that looks like it shouldn't be pulled. Let's pull it. Oh, it's got weird faces on it. Nice. Lovely. Civilizations rise and fall. But when that payback finally comes.
comes around, there's not a second of all that waiting that ain't been worth it. Hey, hey, what do you think you're doing? We got a deal, remember? Let me go! It's over! Our deal was to save Jen. She's safe now. You sure our deal's over, Rico? You checked on your girl lately? What are you talking about? Lenora, my love. At last, you've come back to me. I'm here. Lenora, I've been waiting so long for you, my beloved. Jen, you okay? Bait. Oh my god! So the sequel that would never happen, sadly. And very good of them. Voice over talent gets first billing. That's good work, guys. So that is Splatterhouse 2010. Uh, I am going to do another video um, talking about the development side uh, for, the, for the, like, the final, final video. But as far as the Let's Play is concerned, the Let's Play is done. Uh, this was overall a really solid game. Uh, the last fight being an absolute low point though. Man, the whole Protect Jenny thing was a pretty shitty final fight actually. I, I think a proper boss fight would have been cooler. Um, although I've got a sneaky suspicion there may have been one at one point that might have had to have gone out the cutting room window. But yeah, the game's childish, silly, uh, very simple, all things considered. But honestly a lot of fun, which ultimately is what it's all about. The game's enjoyable, the game's very, very ridiculous, and uh, I think a worthy a worthy point in the Splatterhouse series. I, I, think it's a, I think it's a really good game, overall. Again, the low point being that like that really last bit. You actually cut out, I actually cut out a little bit of me whinging, because I was like, why is this so bad? But, um, yeah, like, overall I had, a really, I had a really good time with it. I think it could have done with a bit more variety with enemies here and there, the, the kills. Uh, after the first few times were a bit too long, a bit too samey, like, you know, the, the cutscene kills. But generally, a lot of really interesting, like, enemy designs, a lot of really interesting set pieces. Rick and the mask, obviously, talking to each other was a lot of fun. Um, and also, rather amusingly, just sort of didn't really hold back, you know, in, in any sense of the word. Uh, like, either with gore, or in this case, nudity, either. It just sort of went, you know what, we're an 18 rated game, let's go for it, let's go a bit, let's go a bit silly. So, fair enough. Either way, I hope you've really enjoyed uh, Splathouse 2010. Uh, I certainly have. Like I said, there will be a follow-up video, not necessarily straight away, but I'll be. Uh, I do want to talk about the um, the development troubles this game had at some point. Um, but that, I think that requires a little bit more research on my part. So, as far as Let's Play is done, uh, concerned, this is done. Thank you so much for watching. I really hope you enjoyed it. I certainly had a blast playing it. And uh, well, until next time. Bye bye.